That was I put that down. Well, we're back. Mr. Pete's and I are back at staging. Pete's just looking at me. We had to run home for a few days. Um, my dad had uh, heart surgery. So, yeah. Let me adjust this thing. I can't make this thing look any better. My face is in it. How could it look any good? How could how good could it really look? Um, what the heck are you doing, dog? I do all my videos live, so you never know what Petey's gonna do. Apparently, he wants to be in the video. There he is, Mr. Beats. But, uh, we had to run home. Bad surgery. We were home for three days. We are hoping to only be home for one, but, you know, it is what it is. Um, man, it sucks that you have to leave. My dad didn't want me to leave, but I gotta make money. It sucks not to be able to be around when people want you around. I don't know. It's hard for them to understand, I'm sure. Especially my dad. I mean, he came from a generation where you got out of high school, you got a good paying job, and you worked there your entire life. Petey is being needy. It's hot in here. Yeah, my truck's got a sun. It's kind of cool. But luckily, this new company is working with me. Work with me. They let me come back. Um, I actually came back to the same well, and they put me right on a load, and it pays pretty well. We're excited about that. P is licking the phone. You guys can't see, but. What do you want, Mr. Pete's? I need to put the camera somewhere else. We're going to work on some mounts. Uh, the camera. It's just my phone. And yeah, we're back here. Back to listen to the stupid damn radio. It'd drive you insane. Hi, Mr. Pete's. He's like, I don't want to listen to the stupid radio no more. Let's see. How can I get... He wants to be part of the show. There we go. Now he's camera shy. There he goes. Ah, it's as if he say, pet me, pet me, pet me. <laughs> he's fun to have here. It makes makes life easier I guess this thing's turning a kind of a vlog type deal I don't know I don't have time to do the editing and that I mean what I do I can do on my phone and that's about it um, but yeah that was rough he had open heart surgery we had to deal with his crazy wife a little bit that was fun <laughs> so he had surgery it took 8 hours and uh this stupid woman I don't know who probably cares this stupid woman calls the hospital we are in the surgical waiting room for 8 hours forever she calls the hospital tells somehow they had shift change so first shift knew we were there the second shift I guess did not I mean well, they assume they did not after they talked to his wife who was not my mother by the way um, she was nice enough to tell them that yeah my dad drove his, uh, himself to the hospital for the surgery because she's bedridden 
whatever. He drove himself to the hospital for heart surgery and that she's unable to see him and there's nobody there for him. Keep in mind, I'm giving his woman updates all day. I'm calling and giving her updates. Um, she's not bedridden at all. She, uh, my dad actually bought her a car three weeks ago, four weeks ago, which she's only driven from the dealership to the hospital. That's it. She's been in the house ever since. <laughs> So obviously there's probably some mental issues going on there. Um, we don't see her much. Usually we go over there, she's hiding. Don't know why, she just hides. Everybody's nice to her, whatever. Yeah, so I message her kids, just your son's wife and say, hey, this is what's going on. They don't care. They're tired of dealing with it, whatever. There's nothing we can do. Just a bad situation. But my dad's doing really well. Um, he doesn't think so. But, I mean, pretty much gutted and they uh, put him back together. Doctor says equivalent to five surgeries. But he's doing really well. Mr. Pete's is doing really well. He's hot. <laughs> he's hot. It's really weird. It is. Oh, well, it's registering right now. I need to turn all this stuff off. Gotta save fuel. Went to get fuel this morning and then the TA was lined up. It was like, screw that, I just need to get up here. Well, I guess I could have got fuel because we're full of trucks. Completely full of trucks. There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven trucks ahead of me, and they can only take five at a time. So I am going to be here forever. That's fine. Whatever. It is what it is. Oh, it means this load will just pay more. Woohoo! It's a good thing about this well that I'm on. They, uh, dog is doing they pay a lot for detention I mean I've got a guaranteed rate for the day um and this well's a long way <laughs> this is rough low L. but 85 miles from the same place to here so this load's paying $900 I think and then plus detention so it's gonna pay quite a bit of money this will be over a thousand dollar load easy and then we got Mr. Pete's being a clown. And that's all I got for today. I guess uh, we'll just make this kind of a daily vlog thing because we won't we'll mix the videos in. Because I don't have time to edit or know how. <laughs> we'll figure it out. Y'all take it easy.